Business owners in Southbury cleaning up today after a devastating fire broke out at a strip mall. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sarah Welch. Dozens of business owners are trying to pick up the pieces now. That blaze broke out yesterday morning at a commercial plaza on Main Street South. News 8's Mark Robbins on the scene in Southbury now with the latest details. The massive cleanup behind me has been well underway for several hours today. Business owners coming back trying to salvage what they can, property, product from their businesses, doing it all under the dangers of the day after a fire. Yes, despite the fact the fire is out, today's heavy winds and the badly damaged buildings combined to become a very dangerous hazard. Well, with the wind, we have pieces of the structure that look like they're swaying, and I have a concern with collapse. So there will be fire and police officials on site to watch and protect the citizens in and around the shopping center. You not only have the structure that's unsound, but we have a lot of nails, screws, broken glass, jagged metal edges, you know, that is just sticking out of the debris. The investigation into the cause of the fire has been completed, although the results will stay incomplete. Our belief is that the fire started in a wall outlet or in an electrical cord plugged into a wall outlet in one spot in the building. Unfortunately, a lot of that material is it was consumed by the fire and we'll never be able to prove that's exactly how it started, but we do know that's where it started. It's going to take several days for the cleanup, of course, to be complete. Now, during the nighttime hours, there is concern about theft. There's a lot of copper piping inside this complex, and police are concerned. That's part of the reason this fence is up. On the scene in South Park, I'm Mark Robbins, News 8.